Alright guys, what's up and welcome to this video. So I've been training a lot of skills lately. Uh, not just ring crafting, but of course that is the topic for this video. However, I'm like 500 XP off a of herbal level, but I'm at that point where I'm so close, but I've got nothing to train it with. And if you're looking at my bank, you can probably see there's a potential gain of XP somewhere, but I think I can make some regular energy pots. I'll see if I can do that. But apart from these regular energy pots, I think they're with Haralanders or not, I have no idea. But after this, I want to go and cap off a skill that I've been training for the last three years of my life. And fuck yeah, hopefully this will get a 61 herb. And I'm pretty sure I was 52 or 53 before this, so in about an hour, I got like eight herbal levels, so that's good. I can now do magic essence mixes, and I can pretty much stop training the skill because that's the most useful thing that I can ever make. Just kidding, I have no idea what the fuck those do, but uh, yeah, I think we better go grab our room crafting pouches and finish off this mofo of a 99, and I probably need to get a pickaxe. I need to wear my gear that I normally wear, otherwise it just doesn't feel right, you know, but I've got it set up for 15 pure or 14 pure essence, so it's going to be a little bit awkward getting more, uh, you know, Getting more than what I need for Herbler out to do these rune crafting runs, but luckily this is the last one I ever really need to do. But of course, after this, um, I will be doing rune crafting more. Um, I probably should grab a Varok teleport. Thanks, dude. I can't type and play at the same time, but I mean and record at the same time. But thank you nonetheless. I should have grabbed a Varok teleport, but I mean I just want to cap this off. 99 rune crafting. Uh, for those who don't know, I've been training for. I'm not too too sure, but I'm pretty sure I've got a fairly decent amount of hours logged this month. I I pretty much came back uh, after my six-month break and got straight back into this skill. And I've pretty much... I think I've done over six mil in the month. So that's quite a lot if you're not used to ring crafting. And uh, it was quite a challenge, but here we are. The Nature and Altar, 106 experience left into the level. And I think it's about time that we do this. <laughs> but there it is, 99 rune crafting. I wish I had the sound. I like the little jingle that plays, but extremely happy with that. I want to get some angles in case there's an opportune screenshot that I'm missing. Uh, but yeah, this is pretty much the hardest 99 for me, at least in the game. Uh, Slave is pretty much up there as well, so I'm not going to say it is the hardest, but um, this is a massive achievement. I know in my HP and attack 99 video, I said that nothing else would really top it. But uh, ring crafting for sure uh, beats the living poo out of those two skills. So you've heard it here first. We need to go get a cave from Aubrey in Varrock. But of course, uh, I need to empty the pouches. Not that much of a waste. But yeah, that is the sickest 99 I will get on this account. It's personally my favorite. Um, in all three aspects, I, th I, I like the skill. Um, why, I, I wouldn't say respect the skill because that's retarded. How can you respect the skill? But I find that the skill, um, I'm going to fucking go out all out for this one. We're going to bust out 10 skill. Okay. That was the best thing that's ever happened in life. Got to put a K at the end. I'm going to buy 10 of these because it's probably my favorite skill cape in the game. It's the hardest for me to achieve. Apart from Slayer. I need to add that little disclaimer, but it, ma it makes it sound more dramatic, you know? So I got to chuck it in there. Um, but overall, it's going to be the skill cape. If you see me in game, I'm probably going to be wearing this cape because uh, I really do like it. And I got it back in 2009, I think. And I think it was about, I'm not too sure. It was like either 355th in FFDN, uh, the clan I was in, or I can't remember uh, in total. But for now, I think I'm like the 120th person to get this. I'm not too sure because people obviously go off the high scores. But of course, we need to buy the cape. And I hate this. Why is there a buy Jagex? I need you to fix this because this is the biggest first world problem in the world, but why why can you not buy more than one skill cape at a time? I'll never know. Please fix. It's a very important detail that I need to be uh, fixed. But anyway, guys, I think I might end the video there. Short, sweet, delicious, and nutritious. 99 root crafting. There is the cape. And for those one defense pures that think you can't get it, without using prayer potions in the abyss, uh... It's possible, because I did it, and you can do it too. I don't know why I'm selling runecrafting, but anyway guys, thanks for watching the video. It's been a massive achievement to get this 99. Um, but anyway, I'll look forward to coming in the next video, 
And if you're going for ring-crafting yourself, good luck. But anyway, take care, and I'll catch you next time. But there's one thing that is kind of missing in this, and I did forget. So this is actually recording like two days later, and I'm not going to show any stats, but uh, I did reach my goal quite easily, to be honest. I think I was at like 800k last video. But yeah, we made our mill goal, and I've been superheating for quite a while. So I'm, I, it was almost at... 11 or oh, what is it, 1100 uh, which is crazy but I think it's now time to sell them because I'm actually running out of money and I actually need money to progress so bye bye to the nat stack I guess but uh, forever in our hearts but anyway I should end it there and I'll see you later